the small but aggressive Stickleback. This is a documentary about the Stickleback. They are probably one of the most amazing fish in the world. I hope you like this documentary. Hope you learned something. They are very common in the UK and even though they're small, they're still quite strong for their size. The diet of the stickleback. Sticklebacks eat all sorts of invertebrates and insect larvae like this bloodworm. You can see how much they love the food. It's not only small food they eat, when they're fully grown they can eat tadpoles and smaller fish and fish eggs. Sometimes they'll actually eat small snails as well. They sometimes eat water fleas and coop pods. This is the stone loach. They are also found in the same habitat as sticklebacks and they also love invertebrates. How to tell male and female sticklebacks apart. This is a female. You can tell it's a female because it's pale in colour and they're grey or sandy coloured. This is a male. It's a male because it's got blue eyes and a red chin in springtime. And it's normally more aggressive than the females. Sticklebacks nature. Sticklebacks are normally aggressive, especially the males. This is him biting my finger. It shows how aggressive he is. The habitat of the stickleback. Sticklebacks can be fresh water or brackish water or salt water. They can live in ponds, which is pretty impressive, and they can live in rivers, streams, and lakes. They like highly vegetated areas, like this part. It makes them feel safe and there's lots of food for them there. How sticklebacks mate. The females get pregnant, the male makes a nest, and the male encourages the female to go into the nest and lay some eggs. Once the female has laid some eggs, the male will fan the nest with his tails to aerate the eggs and then they'll hatch. The design of the stickleback. Sticklebacks have big fins and they are quite well camouflaged and they have big eyes and big nostrils. You can see that they've got normally two spines on their belly and three spines on their back. They've got a big mouth and you can see their spines really well there. The length of the three spine stickleback. Sticklebacks can normally be about six centimeters, but I have heard they can get nine centimeters. Predators of the stickleback. Birds like herons and kingfishers will eat them. Also water beetles and water beetle larvae will eat them. For example, great diving beetles will happily enjoy a stickleback meal. Super fact. Apparently sticklebacks are related to seahorses and pipefish. I kind of get where the seahorses and pipefish come from, but that's still pretty cool. Please subscribe and tell us in the comments if you learned something. Bye!